Y'all, what's good in the hood? If you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit the bell on the side, that way you never, ever miss an upload, y'all. I'm Ching, if you don't know me, and I'm coming back with another video with y'all. I just went shopping, woo woo woo, got a bunch of good stuff from the store. I'm about to show y'all some of the stuff I got. I have a fabric. Look, y'all, first of all, I was so confused at what exactly patterns I wanted to go with in the house. Um, I know that I want my kitchen to be yellow. I'm debating between yellow and um, cranberry. Yellow and cranberry. It looked like I might do cranberry though because that cranberry color slash burgundy is so cute and it's actually in the granite countertop that I have. So yeah, y'all, you see the little specks? Like these little specks. It's like a cranberry color I really love so I might go with that color for that. I just wanted to show y'all a couple of the things I got when I was shopping. I got this curtain for the bathroom. Got my tension rod. Let's see how long I can do it. Oh, it's slipping. It's slipping. Ta -da! And then I have, I found these on sale, which I absolutely love. I might put these at the door. They like some little curtains that's like white, silver, and gray sheer. Those are really cute, I got two of those. I had to get these kind because they're slimmer. You can compact more clothes in one area with the thin hangers. So I know that's gonna save me a lot of space. I just bought a whole bunch of boxes. You didn't see that. Here y'all is the garbage can I just got. It's the kind that open up when you wave your hand across it. I didn't get no batteries. Forgot the batteries. I do really like it though, a lot. And it matches everything else inside the house. This was a new table that I got at the last spot. I always keep me a little fruit basket. I might spray this fruit basket, that cranberry color. That's gonna be perfect to match the whole kitchen once I get it done with a little sparkles of gray or something. And then um, I'm gonna find some chairs to go right with this. Right here is the bar area. I'm gonna put two bar stools right here. That way, you know, sometimes your girl wanna sit high when it's time to eat, instead of sitting low or whatever. This house is a mess right now because I'm unpacking everything, but this is the shower, and I'm going to put that tension rod and the shower curtain right there. So let's put it together and see how we like it, y'all. This is so cute. Okay, y'all, so we got it done. Let's go put it up. Okay. I think we pretty much got it. I want it right on the edge, like right there is. So now it says we gotta twist it. So y'all, this is how it looks, and I absolutely think it's cute. I really, really do like it. I'm gonna put the bottom on the inside. Now I forgot to show y'all what I got um, to eat, y'all. Check out my refrigerator. When I went to the store earlier, I got some baby belly mushrooms, some salad, some eggs. Of course, you gotta have your water. I got some Italian sausage because I'm gonna stuff these mushrooms with it. And your girl, you know I had to get my drinks. Um, I don't drink regular milk, so I got unsweet vanilla. I got some apple cider. I got some sweet tea. Then I got me a couple Minute Maid drinks. Of course, you gotta have your butter. My cream cheese for when I stuff those mushrooms. And then got the cheese to go on it, some shrimp. Gotta have my ice cream. This is so good. Salted caramel cluster. Um, some squash and some corn. But I will be, I still gotta go back to the old house, y'all, and see what all food I have in there. And then whatever I don't have from that point, I'm gonna go and purchase or whatnot. Okay! Under these cabinets, at my old house, I had one of these. Um, which one was for hair and one was for like beauty. But as you see, these are too big. So, they're too big. I went and I got these ones. It's kind of taking a risk for me to use this one. I could take the stuff off and still put it under there. But see, you will have an issue with draining and 
the shit start leaking and stuff because it's loosening up from you consistently putting stuff in and taking it out if it's too tall. So I felt like these would be the perfect size. And yeah, it actually is. It's like the perfect size. These are soft clothes cabinets too, y'all. I'm gonna put one on each side. So right now, I'm gonna go ahead and put together this one. I'll make this my beauty side and the other side is gonna be my, um, you know, the other side, whatever. Any extra soap, like, you know what I'm saying? I put them in here, extra toothbrushes, stop playing with me. Look at my alcohol, extra alcohol that can go in there. Toothpaste, more toothbrushes for when people visit, perfect. Baby oil, Nair, extra deodorant, vinyl gloves. Y'all, I remember when we had a shortage when um, the COVID was coming around, so I have so much alcohol. Toothpaste. Keep them in there. Whatever's related to beauty and health and whatever. Y'all see this one is empty now. Now I'll probably use this to put cleaning stuff in or something. And that's like so perfect. On to the next. Okay, y'all, so clearly I have so much stuff. These are my shampoos, and I'm gonna figure out another way to get this together. My hair oils, um, oils, my tools, all that good stuff, um, all my equipment, my brushes, combs, scissors, and then I'll have my lashes here. That's just what I'm doing for right now, because there's still a couple of other things I need to figure out to get this all the way organized. But for right now, until I get the house the way I want it to be, this is going to work. And y'all have this, my body butters, all this good stuff up under here. Um, Yeah, so that's what it's looking like. Y'all can probably find some stuff, some organizer to put up here for my makeup and two brushes and all that stuff. Y'all see this is pretty much everywhere while I'm trying to figure it out. But I'm definitely going to have like an area for makeup, two brushes, soap. So y'all, this is the mess and everything I decided to throw the hell away. How much crap is that? So y'all, I had to come here real quick and sit down and have an editing session because I forgot that, um, yeah, I was supposed to upload this video for y'all, just letting y'all know what's going on. Right now, I am about to make the other channel. Uh, like I told some of y'all, I am going to, um, I mean, like I told y'all in the last video, I'm starting a new channel. So I'm also gonna list that channel in the description right now so that you can um, go to it and subscribe, y'all, because I'm starting over. And if you haven't seen the last video, then check it out. That way you can kind of understand why I'm starting a new channel, but I do still have the beauty channel. I'm just gonna step the game up on there for y'all so y'all can go and find more, um, not lifestyle shit, but like just beauty shit on there. So yeah, go follow that channel y'all. Right now I got a little music playing back there. Yeah, still getting everything situated. So I'll be back y'all. Um, and then when I come back, um, we gonna get to hanging up these clothes and switching these hangers out and all that good stuff. So yeah. So y'all, this is what I do. I really love lemon water. So whenever I have like extra lemons and I know like they're probably gonna go to waste, I'll take them and I'll make my lemon water immediately with it. And that just makes it where they don't go to waste as well as me getting some that I really like. So let's do it. Of course you rinse them off, cut off the ends. Y'all, y'all know lemons, they dry out over time. So I'll cut it, cut the ends off. This is how I like to cut mine. I keep the seeds in them. And y'all, this little jar right here I got from Ikea for like $12. And then if I have cucumbers, y'all, that's just sitting around that I probably didn't get to eat, I'll do this with the cucumbers too. And we're gonna put this in the fridge, y'all. Okay. And voila! Wow. 
And that's it. Let me shake it up a little bit. We put it right inside the fridge. My bottle is too tall. What am I gonna do? I'm gonna have to drink it with ice. Oh, what am I gonna do? Oh, my bottle too tall, bro. What am I gonna do, bro? <sighs> I'm just gonna leave it over there. It's gonna be warm water, but it's gonna be okay. I'm gonna drink it fast enough so where it don't go bad. I'm gonna find me another container that I could put inside the refrigerator.